Welcome back to the SPD World's Strongest Man, and the athletes are taking on their second event. It's the car deadlift. Simple as this, 795 pounds in the hands. You have to pick it up for as many reps as possible in 60 seconds. They're allowed suits and straps, and the rest is all horsepower themselves. And Martins Lissis looking on, 2019 champion, back to reclaim his crown. Let's find out more about him in his SPD power profile. Martin Slitsis, 2019 World's Strongest Man, 31 years old, 6 foot 3, 335 pounds. I'm living in Marina del Rey, California. This is my uh, fifth World's Strongest Man appearance after two years of a break due to injuries. Back in 2019, I gave it my absolute all, that whole year leading up to that show, to win it. But it took a toll, so I needed a break. I had a lot of pressure to come back, but all good things come with time. I had no doubt that he was going to be back and that he was going to come back strong. Best thing about being back is feeling these nerves firing up again. I feel like right now I'm in the tunnel and all that exists is tomorrow's opening to the qualifiers, winning them what it's going to take to win and just breaking down the event over and over again, rehearsing it over and over in my mind. There was conquering of cosmos always. Well, I want to win one more time. And then, I got other things in mind. I want to build a life where I can help people, where I can inspire people. When I'm out there competing and I think about how badly I need that win, I remind myself I'm not just doing this for myself. He was born to doing something great. Well, it takes such determination, doesn't it, to come back and go for a second victory. Yes, I mean, he won the title in 2019 and has basically been out of the sport since then. But he has come back with a bang, as you can see, in the deadlift, attacking him with everything he has, 795 pounds. And he managed 12 reps, as did Brian Shaw and, of course, Mitchell Hooper. Seven athletes have competed, but it's Hooper, Lissis and Shaw out ahead. So let's see what... Big Texan Trey, Trey Mitchell, Mitchell can do. There's almost nothing he can't do. He's a great deadlifter, I can tell you that. You can see from the long arms he's built for it. Biomechanics are quite important in this. On the whistle. Oh, he's strapped on. And he begins. Strong start from Trey Mitchell. Absolutely. Great rhythm. 60 seconds to do as many as possible. He has to wait at the bottom each time. You can hear the down signal at the top. And then gets a lift signal from Magnus Fair Magnus, our head judge. As and when he's happy that he's not going to try and bounce it with the suspension. That's what he's stopping them doing. Getting close to that, 12 reps. He really is. This is a fantastic performance from Mitchell. But what else does he have? Can he go out ahead? That was a hard one, that was a grinder, he's equaled them. Well, he takes the lead. Eight seconds left, Danny. He might have time for one more. Is it worth the energy? Oh! Oh, well, it wasn't in the end, I'm afraid. But he goes ahead of Hooper, Litsis and Shaw. <laughs> <laughs> Two years in a row, Magnus, he says. Yeah. Yeah, that last year as well, he was right on the whistle with something and he, he didn't get the uh, rubber of the green, so to speak, then, and he doesn't get it either, but it was the right call from Magnus Fair Magnuson. He's an experienced, really experienced referee, and uh, he was just an inch or so short when uh, the minute ran the out. 2020 SPD World Strongest well, on to Man Novikov. representing Ukraine, Alexei Novikov. Shouting Slava Ukraine. Glory to Ukraine. This is an expression we've all heard uh, a lot more recently, and well, it's something he feels so proud about. He's uh, joined up with the special forces now, training with them, and certainly meant he's a little bit lighter and leaner than he'd like to be, but he's so full of heart. My goodness, his nose is bleeding again. He's a man who puts everything on the line every single time. Look at this, 10 reps already. This is 
unbelievably quick, and he is waiting at the bottom. There's no bouncing with the suspension. This is truly extraordinary. This is incredible work from Novikov. Gets to 14. Why not do a 15th? Why not do a 16th? If he's got time for it. Does he have the energy, though? I think he's got time. One more pull. Five seconds left. Ooh, no, he didn't Just get it. Just couldn't do it. Well, I mean, he did enough, didn't he? 15 reps for Novikov. Puts him way out in the lead. Also, he really left Ladies everything out there. The new leader of the deadlift with 15 also, Team Janashia, one of the uh, other athletes who didn't make the final, coming out and helping him. These guys are always helping each other out. It's a, quite a fraternity, really. A remarkably good uh, nature between all of them. Such a lot of sportsmanship World's in the strongman world. Man, so we go on to the defending Tom champion, Stoltman. the world's strongest man, Tom Stoltman. Oh, six foot eight of him. You'd think being uh, really tall wouldn't be good for deadlifting, but as long as he gets the positioning right, it's uh, no real problem. Especially with the extra long arms. They call him the albatross because of that wingspan. This is very deliberate work from Tom Stoltman, just finding that rhythm and not letting it go. Interesting, he's not dropping it at all, which of course uh, makes it bounce up and down. But uh, he realizes he, he's going to be forced to wait at the bottom, so actually he might be being given a lift signal quicker by taking that bounce out of the equation. Could be very clever here. He's on 12. Well, he's on 13. Oh, I don't think he's got many more, though. I don't think so. Crucially, he's gone ahead of the men on 12, the likes of Shaw and Hooper. Now then, can he hunt down Novikov's 15? Oh, he's running out of time. Just a second left. Ah, just beaten by the 795-pound car that ties the second with 13 reps. Dan Hipkiss's coach coming out is having a little word. You, are you all right? That's probably what he's saying. <laughs> The doctor came out as well. It's so exhausting. Let's not forget, it's well over 100 degrees in the sunshine. Representing and, uh, Ukraine. Oh, there's your winner. Absolutely Alexei doing Novikov. it for Ukraine. Here's Novikov. So the 2020 champ takes the event win with a hugely impressive 15 reps. Mitchell and Tom Stoltman tie for second each with 13. And after two events, Novikov takes the lead with 18 points. Stoltman close behind with 17.5. Hooper now drops to third place. And the four-time champ, Shaw, still sitting in the middle of the pack in sixth.